Students are bombarded with images and they're on their media all the time. And taking the history of photography as well as any art history course teaches you how to look carefully and read an image. And I think students don't always slow down enough to pay attention to some of those images that they are looking at and what they might mean or what they could gain from them to understand what's going on in other parts of their lives. Students will learn a lot in this class. They will learn about how photography started, the prejudices against it, the earliest people who worked in the medium. They see some of the greats of photography like Alfred Stieglitz and Edward Weston and Ansel Adams, but they also learn about other people in photography. I've learned it from teaching this course that students really respond well to the medium of photography. I think they aren't as fearful of it as they are of some other art forms. You need a lot of knowledge with painting or sculpture or architecture, and so I think it's a medium that they're familiar with in ways that have nothing to do with the college course, and so they probably feel more comfortable with it.